Now the question here is identify the media shown in the following color play. So here you can see there is a bottle in which a greenish color substance is there. Okay. And if you see negative, yes, there won't be any change in the color. But if it is positive, then you will be able to see certain colonies. And these colonies are generally known as rough, tough and puff colonies. Okay. Rough because these are irregular. If you see carefully, these were be irregular. Tough, they are difficult to lift. and buff because these are pale yellow in color so before proceeding this with this particular question uh, let's see the other mediums given here so the potassium telluride medium lj medium wilson and blair medium and mccomb's medium so i'll be giving you uh, the figure of different medium now this first medium here is your potassium telluride medium this is your potassium telluride medium and this particular medium is generally used for uh, growing the Corine bacterium diphtheria. So it is used for Corine bacterium diphtheria growth. Now here you will be able to see these uh, blackish colonies. Okay, these are generally the gray, grayish black colonies. So what generally happens actually, uh, the potassium telluride media, we have telluride and blood agar okay now and it is inculcated in a co2 rich medium okay there will be more carbon dioxide and this telluride basically becomes uh, when you just uh, reduce this particular telluride it will be becoming grayish and black and this reduction is carried out by corinobacterium diphtheria so that's why you will be seeing these colonies as grayish black okay so basically this is your potassium telluride media in which blood agar is there and telluride is there and telluride is reduced by this bacteria to form grayish black colonies. Now the second important uh, media here is your Wilson Blair media. Wilson Blair media. Basically this is a uh, indicator media okay and it is generally used for growth of salmonella salmonella typhoid okay now the salmonella species can grow here and in which in this particular wilson blair media we use the bismuth sulfide bismuth sulfide and this bismuth sulfide is changed into sulfide and that turns black due to the presence of this particular as typhi that's why you will be seeing the blackish area here blackish colonies and these are nothing but your uh, salmonella species then comes your mcconkey agar so this is your mcconkey agar and in this you will be able to see that a lot of bacteria generally grow here you can grow the lactose fermenting colonies and if the lactose fermenting colonies are grown they will be appearing pink and those which are not able to uh, ferment the lactose they will be appearing as colorless hair so here if you see the scheria coli and enterobacterial aerogens these are going to ferment the lactose while the perfringes vulgaris and the salmonella typhirum are not going to ferment the lactose so these are the various things uh, which we can consider here and one more important thing about all these uh, uh, different culture media is that these are considered as one of the gold standard for identifying the bacteria. Now coming to the figure which is given in the exam uh, in the question here actually. So this is nothing but your Lowenstein Jensen media. So that is also known as LJ media and this particular Lowenstein Jensen media is generally green in color due to presence of malicide green okay and we also add certain other things like uh, hand sack we'll be adding here we'll be add adding some minerals here then after the minerals you will be adding some other important uh, chemicals which can help uh, in growing for example glycol glycerol sorry 
and we'll be adding asparagine. So these are the things which are generally added in this particular algae media. And if you see that the colonies will be here, those are known as rough, tough and buff. And this is generally used for growing the mycobacterium tuberculosis. Okay. And this particular medium can take two to three weeks for growing and it can take up to six weeks for growth of this particular bacteria. That's why you need at least six weeks to uh, declare the sample negative. Okay. So if you just go back to the question here, you will be able to identify that yes, LJ medium is the correct option here. This particular media is used for growing the mycobacteria tuberculosis while the other media like potassium telluride media is used for coronary bacterium diphtheriae mostly and then you have wilson and blair medium this wilson and blair medium is generally used for growing salmonella species and mcconkey's medium so we have already discussed about all these right 